What's good, everybody? It's your boy Slick Fifty Man. About to give y'all my reaction to the press conference today between Javante Tank Davis and Frank Martin. It was good. It was good. But before we get into all of that, man, make sure you y'all like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff, man. Become part of become a part of the million subscribers that you have you don't see yet. You don't see it because you ain't hit that button, man. Hit that button, bro. Help your boy grow. It's the easy way, easiest way to support the channel. Hit that like button, man. Put us in that algorithm. You understand me? Let's get to this reaction. Bruh. I think this is the most active we've seen Javante in a minute, bro. Like for real, for real. But I enjoyed it thoroughly, man. I know he said he was goofy. But man, <laughs> my dude was picking fights with Earl. He was picking fights with everybody on that side. You talking about a cat that's, that that was ready to play mental warfare? Like for real, for real? That was mental warfare, bro. He was trying to get into everybody's head on that side, agitate the mess out of Frank to the point where he told Frank, you're going to be on the ground. I'm going to knock you out in front of your daddy. Like he was, he was on, he was in his bag. A lot of people take it personal, but that that's just boxing, bro. You know what I'm saying? Um, and also want to throw this in there. This yesterday we was talking about uh, him missing grand the grand arrivals, and he was like, "Forget uh, the grand arrivals. I want to do it." What he tweeted, I was just watching a video, and this young lady asked him about it, and he said he explained to her. In the beginning of training, I train in the morning. In the begin and it, towards the end, I train in the evening. And she was like, "So that's what you was doing?" He was like, "Yeah, I, that's what I was training." So he admitted to it. You know what I'm saying? So like, he was training. And I had saw the video yesterday on X. Somebody caught, you know, was recording him run. So around the same time as the grand arrival. So it is what it is. I just wanted to put that out there. So I don't know. But anyway, but uh. <laughs> moving along you understand me now let's talk about frank we know we know what tank gonna bring to the table tank did his spy work he had a mole and ryan garcia camp hey he said he know his train well of course he know his trainers he said he know his sparring partners he know when he train when he eat he know everything frank on the other hand gives off this nonchalant energy people taking as being scared me, I think he's just nervous. This is, you got to understand, this is a big moment for him. The the biggest moment in his boxing career. Right? Um, You got people up there speaking facts on you, like Leonard Ellaby. He started late. Well, half truths. He did start late, but you can't say because somebody start late, they can't be great. Deontay had a hell of a streak. He started late. Uh, but all Hopkins started when he got out of prison. Like, come on, stop playing. So, hey, Frank can't have his his uh his moment. Real talk. This could be his moment, right? His time to shine. You know what I'm saying? You better be on this Eminem. You know, for real, for real. Um But um Yeah, I'm gonna say it. Forget it. All y'all that's out there in my DMs, this and I have fun doing it. So if you ever want to come holler at your boy, go to GMT underscore boxing on IG. I do, I do reply, bro. I do. Hey, hey, it's fun to me. But I literally reply to everybody with the same message. I copied and pasted and just sent it to everybody. Have you ever seen a scared person get put in the corner in real life? Nine times out of ten, they usually come out that corner. Fighting. No lie. Right? So, for everybody saying that he's scared, I don't think that. Because everybody's DMing me. Did you see him flinch? Oh, my God. He's scared. He's scared. Yeah, bro. But that don't make you weak. You know, some people look at it. It makes you aware. Right? He is a boxer. What do, what do you call when somebody swing at you in boxing and they and they do one of these? You get ready to counter. So, I mean, it's boxing, bro. Like, I don't look at it like that. Now, I do say he was nervous 
I, I, I would be scared if he wasn't nervous. Right? Like, what? Like, it would throw me off. So, I mean, hell, even Mike Tyson said he was scared until he got to the ring. All that, all that don't make no never mind of me. What I want to know is, with all the nerves seized down by the time this fight happened in three days. That's what I want to know. I want to know that. I don't I, I don't care about nothing else. When I see that way in, I want to see how he looked and all that. That's what I'm really going to care. I don't care about the, 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 the trash talk is fun. You know what I'm saying? Hell, I forgot the uh, name of the podcast with the football players. Frank on there talking big shit. I mean, he talking big smack. You hear me? Big smack with no problem. You know what I mean? But you, that's what you're supposed to do, right? I mean, it is what it is. But I want to know, does Frank have the skills to pay the bills? I want to know if y'all think that too. Me personally, I think he has skills to hang in there. I think Tank takes this fight. That's what I believe. I believe Tank go ahead and get him up out of there with no problem. But it ain't going to be early. All right. And that's based on Frank's ability. Is he going to come in there and get his respect? People think you got to get your respect just by being having a hard punch. Not so now. You you want the hard punch. Don't get you want to have some pop. But if that's speed there and he can't time you, it's a very good way to get your respect. If Frank come out giving different looks, different level changes, where it's like, okay, I can't time him. I'm gonna have to fight this cat. You know what I'm saying? We may see. Javante revert back to old Javante. Not the Javante that time and everything. The Javante is going to walk through punches and to give it to you. We don't know. But we do know. We do know. As my boy say, the five foot gangster, Javante. <laughs> hey, that knockout punch can come anytime. So, and he got the skills to pay the bills. That's without question. So, for his Frank. Um, having the skills, he also have great footwork. You know the turn tank. I just don't know how long it will last. I don't. I don't know if it's gas tank. Or if I, if I let me say it like this: If I am Javante, I'm going to the belly. We've seen Frank get hit to the body. He don't like that, right? So the, I think that should be. Number one Uno punch. Just come in, body head, body head. But Frank on the hand, sharp jab, the move. If he can hold on to that, he'll be great because I'm going to tell you why. I'm gonna, and I know y'all like, what you mean hold on? Why you keep saying if he can hold on? Y'all keep talking like Frank talking about knocking this dude out. Yeah, today he said, you know, uh, uh, he coming there acting up, I'm going to knock him out. If he come in there acting up, See that part? That mean that tell you he coming there to box. He not coming there to knock Tank out, bro. He said it before. People need to learn to take the words they hear for what they are, not for what you want them to mean. He's coming in there to box. Tank talk. Tank straightforward. I'm gonna knock his ass out. He's not like that, bro. He's a boxer first. So if if that's what he gonna do, I hope he holds true to that and don't go in there rushing. Same thing with Ryan. Ryan could Ryan could have had some success. I still thought Tank was gonna win it, but he got caught because he was rushing the moment. Let's not act like he didn't catch Tank and he was holding on to him for dear life, but he rushed the moment. So if Frank took anything, he just needs his greatest attribute that he needs to have is patience. But I still think on I still think Tank gonna win. <laughs> But I don't think he's scared, though, bro. Y'all need to stop that, bro. I don't think he's scared. Y'all need to cut all that out, man. Yo, let me know what y'all think down in them comments, bro. Or come on over to GMT underscore boxing. Hit me in a DM, man. We can rap. We're going to talk more about this Friday for show. Sure. You know what I'm saying? Y'all going to see my greasy face more often. The show usually starts at 1030 uh, p.m. Central. But like I said, hit that subscribe button, bro. Hit that subscribe button. Can't say enough. Hit the like button and hit 
that bell. I was told closed mouths don't get fed, so I'm letting y'all know that's what I need you to do. Hey, and I promise you, it's free. I promise you that. <laughs> but no, let me quit joking with y'all. No, on everything though, um, I don't know what y'all think. Y'all think he gonna get knocked out early? What round you think he gonna get knocked out on? Let me know. I think it's gonna be a good fight. I really do. And remember, I swear by this. It ain't it ain't that you lose. It's how you lose. You see, Esau, you making that money now, right? Gay Tank is hardest fight. Will Frank be able to top this? We shall see. I'm your boy Slick Fifty, man. And like I said, I'm up out of here. Be easy. Deuces.